Hi everyone and welcome to the ProBuilder 2.0 light mapping tutorial. This will be a pretty quick and short one, mostly because it's so simple to uh, do any kind of light mapping uh, using ProBuilder. All we have to do, uh, number one step, is to first of all make sure that you click the prepare for light map button here. So simply click on that. It'll run through, tell you that it's taken care of it. You can click hooray and you're, and you're set. So now, if we build the light map, all the UV2 channels have been taken care of automatically for us. Let's go ahead and set something up real quick. Make this look a little bit pretty. And I'll just skip ahead to when this is done. And there we have it, all set and light mapped. Just a couple clicks of a button and done. Nothing to it really. Uh, the only thing remaining here is the fact that this isn't really well optimized. Uh, a lot of objects are using up a lot of light map space that they don't need to, and we can make this much, much uh, not only uh, run better, uh, better performance wise, but also just quicker to light map and a uh, uh, less heavy scene and such. So you'll definitely want to move on and take a look at the optimizing tutorial as well. Uh, this is simply a uh, light map setup and then we'll look a little more into um, how you can make most of all this light map much more efficient, uh, quicker to run and um, all sorts of other things within the scene as well. So thanks for looking. That's it for light mapping. See you in the next ones.